little bit chilly out today. A lot of people have been asking me, what does negative 40 feel like? Let's find out. One of the things they had a little bit of fear or trepidation about when I first moved here was the extreme cold. I'm outside right now in shorts and a sweatshirt and it's actually, I think, negative 24. The feels like is negative 39. And if I'm being honest, it feels a lot like 10 degrees. And when I say that, and what I'm trying to say, I guess when I say that is that it's cold, but it's not like anything life-threatening. It's not like it's not like anything that you see in the movies, you know, where a person freezes to death. It's not like that happens when you go outside. It's just a little bit chilly. Um, is there a real risk of like frostbite or anything like that? Yeah, I think there is, but here's a real question. Who's outside with exposed skin for like 30 minutes? Not me. When I was in college, one of the things that we used to do all the time were cold baths, where you get into a water where the temperature is between 40 and 50 degrees. And I would say, honestly, being outside right now feels a lot like that. It's probably closer to one of those cryo chambers that all of the professional athletes use. Um, so it's not life threatening, it's not terrible, it just is. And the one thing that I keep trying to remind people about, I spend almost of my time, whether it, whether it was in uh, <coughs> North Carolina, you know, in December and January, inside, we did practice outside, but here, I would say the conditions for practice are even better because we live in a place where with a 300 meter indoor facility, it's 70 to 75 every single day of the year. It's not windy, it's not overcast, it doesn't rain, it doesn't snow at practice, it's just beautiful. And the other thing that I really like about living here is I get to enjoy uh, the variety of life. I mean, one of the sayings that um, I've always heard growing up is that variety is the spice of life. Well, guess what? Living in a place where it's 75 degrees every single day sounds terrible to me because I like variety. I also like challenge, whether it's a physical challenge, uh, whether it is a mental challenge. I like the concept of living in a place like this because it gives you other things that you have to figure out. One of the things that's really interesting is this house right here is being built by high school students and they come and they work here just about every day. Uh, maybe a fun fact that you might know, not know about me is that I used to work construction when I was in college. And the only days where we would not work is if the high was not going to be over zero. And I worked outdoors and I worked for eight hours every single day. We moved a little bit slower. Um, but you just work outside and you dress for the weather. Everybody around here dresses for the weather. They're prepared for it. They understand it. Um, and honestly, it's not that bad. So I just wanted to talk a little bit about what everybody is so worried about. You know, what's it like living in a place where it gets down to what feels like negative 40? Honestly, it's pretty great. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Have a great day.